question is, what are some examples of how God responds to humankind's early cultural disasters with acts of cultural grace? There's two that stick out in my mind, but both are found in the book of Genesis. One being the story of the Tower of Babel in chapter 11, verses 1 through 9. The people wanted to make a name for themselves instead of glorifying God. God gave them grace by not killing them. Instead, he only confused their languages. The second one is Noah's flood. God gave Noah and seven of his family members grace instead of or grace in saving them when the culture he lived in disobeyed God to the extreme. The sin in the culture, at least from a Christian perspective, is disastrous. For the culture at Noah's time, this example implies that as a whole, man does not do what God tells them to do. Support of these answers would be found in Genesis chapter 6, verse 5, which reads, And God saw the wickedness of man was great in the earth, and that every imagination of the thought of his heart was only evil continually as well as Jeremiah chapter 7, verse 17, verse 9, which states, The heart is deceitful above all things and desperately wicked. Who can know it? Genesis chapter 11, verse 4, Come, let us build ourselves a city and a tower with its top in the sky. Let us make a name for ourselves, otherwise we will be scattered over the face of the whole earth.